Check out this passage in uh, Matthew 19. Then were there brought unto him little children, that he should put his hands on them and pray, and the disciples rebuked them. But Jesus said, Suffer little children, and forbid them not to come unto me, for of such is the kingdom of heaven. And he laid his hands on them and departed. You know, Jesus Christ wanted children to uh, to come to him, to, to believe on him. And, you know, some people think it's impossible for children to be saved. And that's ridiculous. Um, you know, children can believe the gospel. And here's an example of Jesus Christ himself saying, Suffer the little children and forbid them not to come unto me. And, you know, some of these Lordship Salvation type people, um, they think that, you know, because, because they, they're trusting in their own works, they, they think it's impossible for children to be saved because they they don't think that, you know, the works have manifested yet to whatever faulty, made-up standard they decided. And, um, you know, and there's a, there's a lot of people that, that try to, tell parents of children and try to tell children that they're that they're they're, they're not saved that's pretty wicked and jesus said in uh luke 17 2 it is it were better for him that a millstone were hanged about his neck and he cast into the sea than that he should offend one of these little ones that's how serious jesus takes it when people uh, want to offend children, when people want to, uh, you know, condemn children after they believe, it's so wicked. And, you know, that Luke 17 too, I believe that could also apply to, uh, to people who try to make babes in Christ deny their salvation. You know, maybe they're not a physical baby, but they're a spiritual baby. They, maybe they just got saved a few months ago or something like that. And, um, you know, there's a lot of people that just preach heresy and want, want you to doubt your salvation. But Jesus Christ said, those people, it's better for them that a millstone were hanged about their neck and that they were cast into the sea. That they should offend children and new believers and such and um so you know if you if you have children you know preach them the gospel um you know pr pray that they can you know understand it and, and believe it you know um i don't know the exact age that somebody can get saved you know there really isn't it kind of depends on different people you know some people think that you can't get saved until you're like 20 years old well, chapter and verse okay and uh, I think it was in First Timothy, uh, Paul was talking about how, how Timothy's grandmother like taught him the Bible from his youth up. So that's ridiculous. Um, I know tons of people that have got saved when they were like five years old, around, around that age. Um, in fact, my, one, of my, one of my good friends has a son that you know, recently turned five and he got saved a few months ago. So, um, you know, that's all I wanted to, to, to say, you know, uh, have a good day.